guys and welcome back to my channel we're going to be doing a do it at home gel pedicure and right now I have the air Brit polish kit or set I should say and it comes up with about 20 gel polishes with a top coat and a base coat and as you can see it has a lot of pretty colors in there and it is for UV lights it also comes with instructions on how to apply um, the gel polish and then this product is uh, from V shine it is a UV light kit this one um, comes with a whole bunch of stuff so instructions um, tools like cuticle oil and a buffer a tone toe separator alcohol pads um, designs for your nails for your toes or your fingers whichever one you want to use um, gold and silver stripes it has um, white tips white guide tips and uh, jewels and just anything you can think of it, it has a tool in there from the brushes to the the stud applier and the cuticle tool it has everything in there <laughs> so it is a kind of a great investment to make especially if you're trying to just do your feet at home you don't want to spend any money out at a salon all of these are equitable and usable for your pedicure at home this set also comes with a base coat and a top coat And it also comes with it, its own set of gel polishes. So here you'll see that it comes with a whole bunch of nudes, which I love nudes, but I also like color too. And it's about six of them in there. And it has your grays, your tans, your browns, um, your little purple, off purple-ish looking colors. So that's why I ended up getting the Air Brit um, polish set because it has more variety. But if you like your nudes, I mean, you can use this as well. And of course, it has the UV light with the cord adapter as well. All right, so now I'm going in and I'm going to uh, cut my nails down, trim them down because they were whooping <laughs> doing. Uh, this quarantine are staying in the house so I'm trying to trim these bad boys down and whatever I do with my right foot I do to my left foot so I'm trimming those down as well Going in with my nail buffer and I'm going to be buffing out my nails as well as filing them down and shaping them. This is really important because this actually lays down the foundation for those pretty toes that you get when you leave the nail salon.
All right, so far so good. Now I'm just taking my cuticle tool and pushing my cuticles back for that cleaner slick look. And now I am using the cuticle cutter to uh, clean up my cuticles a little bit more, get all that dead skin from around there, get all that gunk out. debris or dead skin that was left behind. And after that, I'm putting on the base coat on my nails and I'm using uh, the Be Shine products for this foot. Also, you'll um, see that on my next foot, I'll be using the Airbrick products. I just really wanted to compare the two um, to see uh, the consistency, the texture of the nail polish, and how long it takes for them to cure and dry. And now you see that I'm curing my right foot for 30 seconds after I put on the base coat. This will be my first layer of gray polish from V Shine. Um, this polish is a little, I wanna say it's a little thin, but I think the texture is just right. Um, I did uh, the first layer and in the instructions, it tells you not to go too thick, else it will take a, a while to dry. So just start off really, um, don't be heavy handed, that's all. And then I cured this for 60 seconds. Now I'm just going in with my second coat. And after that, I'll be curing it for uh, another 60 seconds. Here, I'm just adding a top coat and you guessed it, curing right after for 60 seconds.
All right, now I'm going to my left foot. I'm going to be using the Airbrit products. So this is the Airbrit base coat. And then I'm gonna be using the Airbrit uh, gray gel polish, which is 114. And then I'll be curing for about 30 seconds, oh, 30 seconds, 60 seconds with this one. And I will say that with the Airbrit polish, it is a little bit thicker than V-Shine. So um, just keep that in mind. And it did take me a long time to dry and cure my left foot because the polish was just a tad bit thicker. So as you noticed earlier, I only did one coat for my left foot and I did two coats for my right foot. And here I'm just applying the top the top coat for um, the air brit and curing it for six seconds. But I only did um, one coat for my left foot because like I said, it was a lot thicker. And if I put any more coats on there, I was afraid that it would just be too bulky. Now we're just applying some cuticle oil to the toes. Those cuticles nice and moisturized. Rub those things in. And we're just about done. As you can see, um, there are two different colors. One's from the Be Shine on the right and the other one's from the Air Brit on the left. Let me know which color you like, guys. Um, which brand you like. Um, how the application process was as far as both feet and both brands. I will be leaving the um, products in my description box below. I bought them from Amazon, so I'll leave that link in there. And um, just leave me the comments in the comments below. Let me know what you guys think. Please don't laugh at my toes. This is my first time. <laughs> but um, if you were looking to save some bucks and try to do something at home, it's short and simple. This is it. Talk to you later, guys. Bye.